Greetings, good people, and welcome. I am Keith Stevenson, the spokesman for Reverend Bennett. I implore you, you know in your hearts that this message for Christmas 2015 is good news. Also, after one year in the trenches in Flanders, our Tommy is home on leave. This is the third YouTube broadcast paying tribute to World War I 100 years ago. Please join us in Reverend Bennett's lounge for a song, the message and a drink. This way please. Welcome to Reverend Bennett's Lounge. Let's start with a lovely Christmas song, Jingle Bells. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one-horse open sleigh. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one-horse open sleigh Dashing through the snow in a one-horse open sleigh All oh, the fields we go, laughing all the way Bells on bobtails ring, make the spirit bright What fun it is to ride and sing a sleighing song tonight Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one-horse open sleigh. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one-horse open sleigh. In a one-horse open sleigh. In a one-horse open sleigh. Let's do a, a quieter song now. Drummer Boy. Come, they told me, ra 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 A newborn king to see, ra 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 Our finest gifts we bring, ra 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 Lay before the king, ba ra ba ba ba, ra ba ba ba, ra ba ba ba. So to honor, ra ba ba ba, when we come, little baby, ba ra ba ba. I have no gifts to bring To lay before a king Shall I play for you I played my best for him I played my best for him Then he smiled at me
Thank you, everyone, for coming. And to our friends on Facebook and YouTube. I hope you enjoyed those jolly songs and the poem from Tommy. By studying the living conditions in the trenches across France and Flanders 100 years ago, the Rev Bennett has found a parallel to our lives which has good news. The title is Don't Look Over the Top of a World War I Trench. From research on various online papers, a number of Tommies were killed in their home trenches for a number of reasons. Drowning in the mud, bitten by a rat, sight seeing. The temptation to have a look over the top of a trench into no man's land could become unbearable. With German snipers waiting on the other side, the Tommy could die instantly with a German bullet in his head. How may this sightseeing relate to modern life? Pornography has been around forever and may seem like a little bit of harmless fun to have a look. But looking at such images may be similar to having a spiritual bullet in the head. One German sniper can kill one Tommy at one time. Social media, be it YouTube or Facebook, can be used by a person to send pornographic images to many people at one time. Holy Scripture leads us to different values in life. Proverbs 1 verse 2 Attain wisdom, discipline, understanding and a prudent life. Proverbs 1 verse 7 Fools despise wisdom and discipline. Go on, have a look. Genesis 3 verse 1 Go on, take this fruit. Pornography won't hurt you. Adam and Eve should have reached for the delete button when Satan was offering his goodies to them. The fruit that was out of bounds. Yes, Adam and Eve did exist, but that's another story. We are encouraged to press the delete button when the fruit that is out of bounds reaches us. Social media is amazing and powerful. It is used to convey this message of hope to you. Our family did experience social media abuse while attending our town's Christmas light switch on ceremony. A family mobile device was hacked into with hard porn, then sent to dozens of Facebook friends. This is a spiritual bullet sent to us, then transmitted to dozens of unexpected people. It is ironic that Satan used this activity during the start of the, na the town's national celebration of Jesus Christ's birth. The delete button was activated with success. On talking further with our family member, 
it appears that God's Spirit has given some protection from viewing such pictures. He views such images as a pointless bore. This shows a certain street wiseness. Let's offer some rejoicing that the baby was the Christ, was crucified for us, and is alive now. Also, this everlasting personage is full of understanding and forgiveness. A previous YouTube broadcast, the 4th of August 2015, revealed the good news of the resurrection at Jesus Christ's second coming. This Christmas message takes us to the next step. Jesus Christ's kingdom. Isaiah 9, verse 6 and 7. His kingdom in the future. It will be a time of education in righteousness. Will email, YouTube and Facebook be used? Let's hope so. Isaiah 11, verse 9. Will those who abuse social media such as downloading porn, be taught a better way to use their cleverness by angels and God's team. Let's hope so. Jesus has the power and wisdom to cancel out the clever tricks of Satan and build a wonderful world. If this true story has inspired you to be more streetwise, and not be taken in by Satan's clever tricks. There is one action to take. Prayer. Please join us now for a drink with Tommy. Hello Tommy. Hello. Great to have you here. Great to have me here, yeah. <laughs> Let's uh, have a drink. <laughs> so what have you got for us? Cornish mead. Oh lovely. That'll explode. <laughs> All together now. Cheers! Cheers.